So a rare find in Deception Pass, actually on the shore, has a Monroe couple I met yesterday still in awe, actually, oh, because yeah. the fish they found was this big, actually no. way bigger than that. It was like seven feet long. Uh, take a look at this video. Here we go. Craig Leone and his girlfriend, wow. Kristen Berg. There it is. His it, that eye right there is the size of his fist. They spotted this silver object. They think it's a pan. Turns out it's this huge fish. It's actually a kind of ribbon fish that lives really deep, like three to 4,000 feet deep, so humans rarely ever get to see them. And they're also actually surrounded by local legend named the King of the Salmon by the Macaw Tribe because the story goes that these fish lead all the other salmon to spawn. The couple did not know any of this when they found it. They just found, they thought, a really freaky big fish. How tall are you? 5'9". And it was taller than It was you. taller than me. Well, the first thing I noticed was the eye. The eye was about this big. If you look at the pictures, my hands, it was easily my palm. It turns out these particular fish live at about three to 4,000 feet. So what did you think when you learned just how rare it is to be someone who sees one of these fish washed ashore? It's kind of surreal. Yeah, we went to a restaurant for dinner shortly after and showed a couple pictures to some people. And the next thing we know, the waitress is carrying my phone around the restaurant and everybody's going, holy moly, that's huge. Oh my gosh. So it's actually really bad luck to catch one of these fish if you're okay. out in the open waters and typically they're out in the ocean. It just somehow made it into Puget Sound um, because of this legend that they lead the other salmon to spawn. So if you take one of them and there's all these salmon around that don't know where to go to lay their eggs. Yeah, but three to 4,000 feet deep. Are people actually fishing that deep? For no, don't ruin it. Don't ruin Sorry. it, Jordan. I'm just <laughs> thinking like logistically. I'm like, oh my gosh, that is a deep swimming fish. Yeah.